hello friends and welcome to youtube channel freedom tech and in this session what we are going to learn friends in this session i will share with you a new project where we are going to use google vision model google gemini vision model and we will use the model with raspberry pi 4 using raspberry pi 4 camera module we will not use here usb camera we will use here raspberry pi camera module simple and then we have our vision agent so with the help of our ai vision agent we will detect a car number plate and we will detect the car uh, car company name also simple so for that we will not use any uh, yolo model or any tensorflow model we will directly use google vision ai agent we will capture the image using our raspberry pi camera module and then we have our own ai agent which act as a number plate detector simple so before we move to our practical friends if you learn something from our videos please consider to subscribe our channel okay friends thank you so much and let's get started so friends as i mentioned Today we will use only Google Vision AI agent with Raspberry Pi 4 latest Raspberry Pi OS bookworm 64 bit version and then we will use we have here our Raspberry Pi 4 camera module and with the help of camera module we will capture the live image of a car number plate then we will send that image on Google Vision and then our AI agent will response simple also we are going to save the number plate and uh, we have here other details also simple so let's get started so for that first i have created a repository inside that i have mentioned the full code simple and then i will mention the link simply copy paste the link inside web browser then go to the code click on download zip and it will download our zip format repository done so let's just close our github page and then because we will use here gen ai so we need key so go to the solution gemini api then get api key And then here as you can see I have already one created key so I will delete that one simple and then just click on create API key here select any any of your previous project and then just click on create API key it will create the API key we created our API key just copy it done so we have done with our api key and we also downloaded our repository so let's just close the web browser simple and then uh, i have created here a text file inside that text file i will simply paste the api key simple so friends now we have our api key we have our repository now let's just open file manager and then we will go inside our repository and this is what our repository as you can see right click click on extract here it will extract our repository if you open the repository inside that we have our tony python ide the python code for ai agent the vision ai agent then right click and just open with the help of tony it will open the code with the help of tony python ide that's it as you can see this is what our code and here you will see that i have mentioned the pi camera 2 because we will use here raspberry pi 4 camera module so we need to mention or we need to import the pi camera 2 module and then the other modules like opencv so we will search for just go to the tools go to the tools and then let me show you here again go to the tools then manage packages click on it it will open the manage packages window as simple as it then open cv hyphen python open cv hyphen python hit enter it will search for open cv hyphen python first package click on install it done it will install 
OpenCV hyphen Python on our Raspberry Pi. This is the latest uh, operating system Raspberry Pi Bookworm 64 bit version. That's it done. Uh, then we need Langchain. So Langchain, hit enter. Langchain, Langchain. We have here Langchain as you can see. There is no problem. So Langchain, just click on install button, done. It, it will install Langchain. Okay. Langchain hyphen Langchain hyphen core. Our next package. First package. Click on install button, done. It will install Langchain hyphen core also. Then we need Langchain hyphen Google, Google hyphen Gen AI. Hit enter. Langchain hyphen Google Gen AI. It will uh, searching for the package, first package. Click on install button, done. It will install Langchain hyphen Google Gen AI. So this is how we need OpenCV. We need Langchain. Langchain hyphen core, Langchain hyphen Google Gen AI. Done. And here we want to mention our uh, key. So we have our key. Let's close all these things. And this is what our key where we uh, paste our key. Just copy the key. Open Tony and here we will paste it. Done. Save the code. Now let me close the text file. That's it. Now we mention our key. Then this is the model, Gen AI Vision model, the latest model. Then we have here PyCam2, the variable which represents the Pi Camera 2 module. Then we will configure. As you can see, this is how we call our Pi Camera with the help of PyCam2. As simple as. Now what is the concept? We have our camera module. As you can see, PyCam2 Pi dot capture array. Then we will flip the frame as per your requirement. I have set the camera like this way. So I need to flip this way like this way minus one. I will show you if I start the camera, the, if the camera angle I want to change, I can simply mention here one or minus one as per your requirement, how you set the camera simple. So I have set the camera. So uh, the Raspberry Pi 4 camera like this way. So I want to mention here the minus one. Simple. So you can either mention here one or minus one as per your camera setup, the Raspberry Pi 4 camera module setup. Remember one thing friends here, if you don't know how to configure the camera module or how to connect the camera module, I have already created the video how to connect the camera module with the Raspberry Pi 4 or you can simply visit their official website the Raspberry Pi 4 Raspberry Pi camera website or let's just say Raspberry Pi official website you can you will get the you, you will get the documents how you can connect the camera module simple so there is no worry about the connecting camera with the Raspberry Pi so I have already done I have already connected the camera. So I hope you all clear why I have mentioned here a minus one for flipping the angle for flipping the angle of the camera simple and then we will use cv2.cvt color we will convert the frame into RGB to BGR format. That's it and then the what is the concept the concept is what when we capture the frame so for capturing frame we want to press the C button from the keyboard. We want to press the C button from the keyboard. It will capture the frame and it will send the frame to Gen AI. So this is the function for analyze vehicle related information. So this is what my agent prompt. As you can see, this is what my agent prompt for car number plate. You are a traffic surveillance AI. Analyze the given image and extract key vehicle related information. Car number plate. This is what my first priority. Clearly identify the number on the plate. If it is visible, car model and type like SUV, sedan or hatchback. Then the brand, the company name like Toyota or BMW. Then the color, which is the primary color like red, orange, blue, whatever it is. And other observations like uh, mention any suspicious elements nearby the car multiple vehicles or people 
simple i hope you all clear now when we start the code it will start the camera module so let me start the camera module i have here uh, in my mobile i have here uh, some uh, car images so i will show the car image to raspberry pi 4 camera module and it will detect it will detect the number with the car model okay and it will save the information inside the text file so as you can see this is the this is basically my mobile and if i make like this way little bit bigger remember one thing friends i am showing the image using the mo mobile okay in real scenario you have a real car simple so i hope you all see clear now i'm going to simply press the keyboard c button as you can see it's captured the image and we have result in one second only one second we, there is no training main main thing is what there is no yolo there is no tensor flow nothing only Google, pure google ai vision agent so we have here car number plate the text the car model type the brand of the car like swift model maruti suzuki red color and the image appears to be photo screen displaying the car image means it's clearly say that this is the image which basically uh, inside the screen inside the screen it means it is inside the mobile simple so now this is what my agent response this is what my agent response if i stop the code and if you open the repository where we have this code inside downloads this is what my code and here it is as you can see we have created a text file right click text editor open it with the text edit, and this is the information friends as you can see the date the current time with the car number with the car model and the company type the color which is the red and other observation simple so this is how friends you can use pure gen ai vision agent with the help of raspberry pi 4 camera module and you can create the project where you can detect the car number plate i have mentioned the full code i hope you learned something from this video we'll meet our next video till then thank you Jack and bye bye